Hello everyone, Tyler here. It's been a while since I've shown you a video because it's been a while since I've had something worth showing you. And I've also been moving to this nice new workshop, uh, part of my two car garage. Um, and now I'm ready to finally show you something. Here we have the M Drawbot from Makeblot. This was a Kickstarter that I purchased. Um, don't remember when or how much. It's been under my bed for a while. This thing came bloody fast. Uh, this was here within a couple weeks of the Kickstarter ending. It was amazing. They must have had them ready to sell um, before they started the Kickstarter. Um, but as you can see, the Drawbot makes four different things. Uh, the Scara, which is what we have here, as well as the draw car, Eggbot, and a spider, which you can hang from a whiteboard or perhaps a wall even. Uh, it came in the nice packaging you see with a nice instruction guide almost like a Lego kit. The whole assembly took me about an hour to assemble the Scara. Uh, I would say this is something you could give a child. It was fairly simple. Uh, maybe a, a 13 or up you could give it to them and trust that they would get it assembled. Uh, worst case with a little help from dad. So let's take a look at it. This is the way it came. I've taped the connector up here because the connector was getting stuck on the table. And I didn't want that to happen anymore. It was messing up my drawings a little bit. But it seems to be working much better now that I've done that. And so far no ill effects. This is the computer board. Uh, I've taken the battery box off for easier access. Uh, it comes with a couple ESCs. They hook up with Cat5 cables, right to the NEMA motors, and the small little micro servo, a little 9 gram, I guess it's a continuous rotation device, doesn't need to be. And a little rubber band holds it, comes with the pen. And I've got it set up to draw on a standard piece of paper. Uh, I've taped down the paper with my trusty glow in the dark Batman tape. And I'm going to put one last piece on here. So now my paper should be good. You see not moving around. And we should be good to go. This is the MDraw program that they provide. I've set up a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle thing. My son asked me to draw. So we're going to give it a go. With all that said, in MDraw, we're going to come up here and hit play. And we're going to watch it go. Off it goes. Now, for the most part, I'm going to shut up and let the device do the talking for me. And uh, you can listen to it run. After a few minutes, I am going to put it into a time lapse. This is a really long draw. I've not done one this long. Most of the ones I've done are just a couple minutes. This one appears it's going to take quite a bit longer. So we'll put it into a time lapse after after maybe three or four minutes. So enjoy.
Okay, everybody. I've let it run real time for about five minutes now. Um, officially, it is 1% complete. So this is going to take some time. Uh, I do have the speed setting set very low at the moment because I wanted a little better drawing. Uh, I'm hoping anyways. We'll see. Uh, the first couple were a little shaky at the high speed. So you can see it's now 1157 my time. Still kind of early in the afternoon. I'm going to put this on time lapse now and uh, we'll let it run. We'll see how long it takes. Gents, um, we are now 31% into our drawing. You can see, if I zoom in and focus, if I can, it is quite the detailed drawing. This is going to take some time. I'm going to put it back on the time lapse. Focus it back in and let you know it's now 1214. Okay, so now you know where we're at. I'm going to put it back on the time lapse. Okay, everybody, we are now 78% complete with our project. It is 1233, so everything's been running close to 45 minutes. It's coming out beautifully. You see, I'm getting some small little black dots appearing when the pin goes down. Not sure what's causing it, other than maybe the speed of the pin going down. But we'll work on that. I'm going to put it back into time lapse and let this complete. And you see how the pin goes up and down. Certainly doing a better job than I could by hand. So. Okay. And that's complete. Uh, the last few minutes of the video went mighty quick. It's now 12.38. And we are 100% complete. That's it with our MDrawBot today from MakeBot. I'm going to move the pen to home and let you get a good picture of the drawing. Now you'll see the black dots are quite prevalent where the pin went up and down a lot. I think I'll be able to get those out of there by adjusting how much the pin raises. Uh, but that might be for a future video. Sorry about my shaking. Uh, that might be for a future video. Altogether, this didn't take long. An hour to build. Something a child could do. It is an awesome product. I would definitely recommend somebody else purchasing one of these. That's it. Thanks for watching my video. If you liked it, please press the like button. And ultimately, if you want to see more, subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Have a wonderful day.
two, one, jump! 